Good morning. Oh, and right on cue, one of the kids are calling out for me. Josie, we're training. Do you want to come and say good morning? Come on. No, no. But she has got her accessories already this morning. Little shiny cat purse. It's Monday here in Australia. And we have three sessions left before we hit it back outside. So we're going to make it good. A few less people, it looks like, maybe online. Lazy. <laughs> oh, <shit. laughs> Not off to a good start. I hope you catch it up a bit later. Special hi to the Martins over in the US. Welcome. Good afternoon. Setting you up for a good night's sleep. Steve had a rubbish one. And so he's got to go and run 11Ks after this. All right, we're going to get into it really soon. Good morning, all. Really good to see you. For those in Canberra, our Gungalan boot camp is booked out. Couple spots left in Woden. Snooze, you lose. Good. Or early bird, you know, all those sorts of things. Anyway, we're going to get warm. It's a good one. You don't know that. I don't know anything. <laughs> we're going to ease into it, though, because I also need to run 11K after this. So he'll break me, because that's what he does. Do you want to say good morning now, Josie? No. You want to show them your purse? There it is. All right, let's get warm. Okay, jog on the spot, Mum. All right, jog on the spot. All right, let's start it nice and slow to start with. Just jog on the spot. All right, boost the glutes, change. Feet up to your backside. And rest there. We're finished. Oh, yeah, good. Okay, good job, guys. Uh, you can go now. No, I'm only joking. All right, high knees change. Knees up. Boost the glutes change. Feet up to your butt. High knees change. Boost the glutes change. Feet up to your butt. Jogging change. When I say sprint, sprint on the spot. All right, we'll keep it nice and short. Three, two, one, sprint. Five, four, three, two, one. Jogging change. Get ready to go again. In three, two, one. One, sprint, bust feet. Five, four, three, two, one, jogging, change. Get ready to go again in three, two, one. Sprint, bust feet for five. Come on, Mel. Four, three, two, one, jogging, change. <laughs> We're gonna buy shares in chocolate yogurt after this. <laughs> All right, when I say left, touch ground, left hand. When I say right, touch ground, right hand. When I say both, bend down, touch ground, both hands, do a big jump. Left, right. Right, left, left, both, both. High knees change, both, both. High knees change, both, both. Left, right, both. Sprint, pass feet. High knees change. Wow, oh, Mel, feral. Boots to glutes, change. If only your name was Cheryl, we'd call you Cheryl Feral. <laughs> both. Both, both, both. Sprint, my seat. Honey's change. And sprint for five, four, three, two, rest. One arm high, one low, slapping it in front of the body, reach the way back. Bicep behind your ear, full range. Gradually increase the speed. All right, a little bit faster, a little bit faster. Ball three, two, one. Steady, roll the shoulders forward, nice big circles. Get your arms up nice and high over the top of the head. Roll the shoulders all the way forward. A little bit faster. For three, two, one. Directions change. Roll them back, nice big circles. Let's right, warm that shoulder up. If you're old, all right, you need to probably do twice as much. This is why we're going to start a little bit slower. For five, oh, four, three. We will. Liar. Two, one. Steady, pop across front of the chest. How can we do burpees for a whole session without calling it a burpee workout? Oh, wait. Go back that, to the last session. That was the last session we did. <laughs> Three, two, one, and steady. Don't move too far, Mel, because you're going to do mountain climbers to start with. Hands on the ground, knee to chest, jump up, change the legs over. This is the easing into it, so we're going to go for 20 seconds on, 10 seconds off. Mel, move into position. Everybody else, hands on the ground, get ready to start. Move at your own speed. All right, we're going to do eight sets. Get ready to start. Mount climbers in five, four, three, two, one, and up. 19, 18, 17, 16, 
15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, rest. In fact, we'll do six sets. So we've only got five left because I'm already looking at the clock and I'm already losing time. Get ready to go in five, four, three, two, one. Mount climbers, go. 19, 18, 17, 16, 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10 seconds, nine, eight, seven, six, five seconds left, four, three, rest. Four more sets, four more sets. All right, you move at your own speed. If you need to stop, then stop. Get ready to go in five, four, three, two, one, and up. 19, 18, 17, 16, 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10 seconds. Punch it out. Nine, eight, seven, six, five seconds. Four, three, rest. Three more sets, three more sets. All right, this is the warm up. This is the warm up. Five, four, three, two, one, out. 19, 18, 17, 16, 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10 seconds, nine, eight, seven, six, five seconds, four, three, rest. Two more sets, two more sets left. Two more. All right, get ready to go. Mountain climbers in five, four, three, two, one. Mountain climbers, go. 19, 18, 17, 16, 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10 seconds, nine, eight, seven, six, five seconds, four, three, rest. One more set, one more set. Have I just built a workout with mountain climbers all session? Yes, I have. I'm only joking. Five, four, three, two, one, mountain climbers. Go, last set of mountain climbers for the whole workout. There you go. 16, 15, 14, 13. This is why we have trust issues in our house. Nine, eight, seven, six, five seconds, four, three, rest. Oh, you're lucky you didn't see an eyeful of that. Nudie it a, run. It was a little nudie run. <laughs> okay, focus. Okay, we're now doing two exercises. We're going to do... Deep jump squats, because your legs are warm now. We're going to do deep jump squats, and we're going to do King Kong push-ups. Down, up, beat your chest. Down, up, beat your chest. If you need to use your knees in the push-up, then do so, but make sure you hit depth. Now, I know Mel likes this one, so I gave it to her for the Monday morning. You have 50 jump squats to do, 50 jump squats. And if you need a rest, drop down, do 10 King Kong push-ups, and then get back up, and then continue your jump squats. Once you've done a cumulative 50 deep jump squats, you're going to swap the two around. So you'll do 50 King Kong push-ups, and every time you need a break, you'll stand up, do 10 jump squats, and then drop back down. Let's do it again. Your goal is to try and get through 50 reps for each, and every time you need a rest, just change to 10 reps of the opposite exercise. Melly, move into position. I can feel that coffee starting to power me up. All right, 50 deep jump squats with good form. Every time you need to stop and have a break, drop down, do 10 King Kong push-ups. Get ready to go in three, two, one. Up. This is one of Mel's favorite workouts. So there you go. Don't say I don't do anything for you. All right, this is my version of flowers. <laughs> poor Mel. Fifth. Oh, poor, poor Mel. Mel. Oh, poor Mel. Oh, she has to exercise. Oh. <laughs> go and eat your chocolate yogurt the rest of you. Far out. 50 deep jump squats. Once oh. you've finished your 50 <laughs> deep jump squats, you're going to do 50 King Kong push-ups. So don't, don't overcomplicate it. Just do 50 jump squats and 50 King Kongs. Every time you need a rest, do the opposite exercise for 10 reps. So Mel is having a rest from her jump squats. She's doing 10 King Kongs. And then she's going to get straight back up on her feet and she's going to continue her jump squats. Once she's finished, 50 deep jump squats. 
then she's gonna do her favorite exercise of 50 King Kongs. Your goal is to get through 50 reps of each. And obviously, if you get through 50 reps of each, all right, and you're feeling pretty good, then just start again. Start again, because you're not a hero. Good form, Melly. It's only taken us how many weeks? 10 weeks? Far out. If only we could go back and look at some of the replays from 10 weeks ago. The rubbish form that I let you get away with 10 weeks ago. What's up? Your knees? It's because you're old. No, she's not. She's 21. <laughs> That's what we tell the kids. They're like, but how old is mum turning next year? 21. <laughs> But dad, her age doesn't change. That's right. She's 21. 10 King Kong push-ups. Good, 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 good. Now you have four minutes. Four minutes. All right, this first workout is short and fast. Okay, your job is to try and get through 50 reps of each. 50 jump squats, 50 King Kongs. 10 reps of the opposite every time you need a rest. And it was like, come on, why are my legs not strong enough? I'm sick of doing these push-ups. Oh, you finished already? Far out, Noddy. Okay, here you go. Keep me on my toes. All right, Mel's finished her jump squats. Now she's doing 50 King Kong push-ups. She's gonna run burgundy the shit out of it. I don't know if you just noticed, but I just did a thousand repetitions. Okay, so Mel's doing King Kong push-ups. She's doing 50 of them, 50 of them. Okay, every time she needs a rest, she's gonna stand up, she's gonna do 10 jump squats. <sighs> Julesy, can you get some clothes on, please? Okay, go and get dressed. This is why I'm standing in front of the reflection so we don't see his moody Rudy <laughs> far out. <laughs> what outfit is she going to put on today? <laughs> the many outfits. And then if only you could see the reflection in the other window. You've got Mel's dog licking the window, looking at her. <laughs> Between kids and dogs, far out. I bet you've been in my garden bed again, haven't you, Jesse? Yeah? Useless dog. <laughs> All right. You finished yet, Melly? Yep. Oh, shit. What are we doing? All right. You got two and a smidgen minutes left. Two and a smidgen. All right. Let's finish strong. Finish strong. I know Margot's finished. Good job, Margot. If you haven't finished, pick your game up. Come on, Blake. Pick it up. Lift, 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 lift. I don't know if you guys spent less time writing, putting emojis up, more time doing squats and push-ups, you'd probably finish your reps faster. How many reps you on, Melly? 30. She's on 30. She's got 20 to go. Come on, Mel. Come on. Finish it off. You have 90 seconds. 90 seconds. 90 seconds, Mel. Try and finish 20 reps. Poor Mel. Poor Mel. We put her on the spot. It's for her own good. I'm just going to have a good set of cannons. Come Christmas. But we're gonna keep working until Christmas. Come on, push, 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 push. 60 seconds. You got one minute left, one minute left. Get as far through it that you can. Get as far through this workout that you can. As far through that you can. Lots of moving parts today. It's quite confusing. If you're trying to write this workout down, you'd look a little bit confused. That's okay. Lots of components to the phase workout. 40 seconds. Finish it off, finish it off. Strong, Melatron, strong. She just finished her. Okay, Nicole Burke, you are joining this class very late. How are you going to go when we get back outdoors? I hope you're not going to be late. 19, 18. 17, 16, 15, 14, 13. Come on, 12, 11, 10 seconds left. 9, 8, 7, 6, 5 seconds. 4, 3, 
Rest. Have a little breather. Good first workout. Okay. We're now going to do three exercises. I can't even hold the three fingers up. Three, three exercises. First one will be pike squats or mothers, depending on what I want to call them. So grab your toes, feet together, all the way down. Let your heels come off the ground. Straighten the legs. Second exercise, shoulder push-ups. Rock forward, bend the elbows all the way down, all the way up. And the last one, Mel's favourite, toe taps. Legs up, roll the shoulder blades off the ground. Isolate your head. Pretend you've got a neck brace on so you don't bob your head around. Now, <coughs> once again, with the toe taps, right, it's just a crunch. Don't beat around the bush. Now, we're going to do the exact same format we just did in the last round. But this time, we're going to do it with three exercises. We're going to increase the reps up to 100. So, you're going to do 100 pike squats or mothers, 100 shoulder push-ups, 100 toe taps. Every time you need a rest, you'll do 10 reps of the next exercise. So, I'll remind you as we go what we're going to do. So you're going to start with 100 mothers, and every time you need a rest, it's 10 shoulder push-ups. Once you've finished that, once you've finished 100 mothers, you're going to do 100 shoulder push-ups. 100 shoulder push-ups, every time you need a rest, you do 10 toe taps. And then the third round that you're going to try and get through, what's going to be pretty easy, is 100 toe taps, and every time you need a break, it's 10 mothers. You probably won't need many rests. All right, Mel, move into position. Let's get ready to start. 100... Puck squats or mothers, however you want to count them. The dogs are playing in the background. You might get glimpses of the reflection. All right, get ready to start. Feet together, grab your toes. Puck squats in three, two, one, and begin. Now, I know some of you are going to do 100 in one set. This is good. This makes me happy. But then I want you to roll straight into then 100 shoulder push-ups. So, enjoy. So, 100 Pike squats or mothers, whatever you want to call them on this glorious morning here. 100 reps. Every time you need a rest, 10 shoulder push-ups. 10 shoulder push-ups. Let's try and transfer as much weight to your shoulders as you can. 10 shoulder push-ups. All right, and then try not to stuff around afterwards. Try and stand straight back up, grab your toes, and go straight back into it. Because ultimately, you're here to exercise. You're here not to stand around. All right, and watch Mel's arm grow before our eyes. All right, 100, 100 mothers or pike squats, whatever you want to call them. All right, and 10 shoulder push-ups every time you need a rest. All right, the next round is 100 shoulder push-ups with 10 toe taps every time you need a rest. Okay, so the reps are very similar, similar format, but we're just doing it now with Three exercises, three exercises. All right, lots of moving parts this morning. All right, the dogs are about to have a big fight in the background. It's like Mortal Kombat out there. Come on, Bullet, finish her. Fatality. <laughs> he knows I'm talking about him because he's looking up at me. All right, 100 pike squats. 10 shoulder push-ups, 100 shoulder push-ups, and 10 toe taps. Right, remember, with all these, these workouts, you can move at your own speed, your own speed. It's accessible for everybody. Okay, you could do this if you're just starting out training. Yes, it might seem hard at the start, it might seem hard, all right, but exercise is not supposed to be easy, it's supposed to be challenging. Well, that's not supposed to be rainbows and lollipops and all things nice. If you <sighs> have not exercised in a long time and you think it's just going to be easy, <sighs> right, you need a swift upper kick to the freaking face. Right? A spark kick to the face. Right? It's supposed to be hard. It's supposed to be tough. It's supposed to challenge you. It's supposed to challenge your body in a way that it's going to create some form of change. We're going to make your muscles stronger. We're going to strengthen your lungs. We're going to strengthen your heart. We're going to strengthen your mother freaking resolve too. But when things get a little bit tough, you flip them the middle bird and then you keep going. All right, so if you're starting your day, hopefully you'll be a pussycat for the rest of the day and you won't get in trouble with HR. Mr. Nelson's here. I'm talking to you. Lucky you're your own HR now. If you're finishing your day, are you doing this at some other stage? Well, hopefully you sleep well. Don't do a me and 
drank a bottle of Fanta that we got with our pizza last night, yes. Bottle of Fanta, sugar, carbohydrates. Too much, too much. All right, you finished your 100 yet, Melly? God, what are we doing? Finished. I feel like we're planting some sunflowers. Okay, you got 100 shoulder push-ups now. Don't do them all in one set. Okay, so Mel's just finished her mother's far out. I thought they'd never be finished. I thought that'd be you'd finish them in two shakes of a donkey's ass crack. Okay, 100 pike squats, 10 shoulder push-ups every turn in your rest. Once you've finished your pike squats, you're doing shoulder push-ups. You're doing 100 shoulder push-ups and 10 toe taps every time you need a rest. All right, essentially just doing a crunch. You're doing 10 crunches. And you roll back over, back into shoulder push-ups again. All right, upper body, lower body. Upper body, lower body. All we're doing is just sending the blood around your body. Not beat around the bush, nothing creative has happened in the fitness industry. Probably in the last 2,000 years, unfortunately. Heart rate goes up, heart rate goes down. Good form, Mel. You're moving not bad this morning. I said it's not bad, it's not great either. It's somewhere in between. I think you've got like a, a really, really strong C at the moment. Maybe a low B. The other dog's turned up now to have a look at the window. See what that crazy lady's doing. The ball's like, well, all you gotta do is just chase some rabbits. That'll keep you fit. All right, and then when you catch them, you don't wanna know. Oh dear. Hope some of you didn't visualize that just then. I know some of you get a little bit worried about that. Shoulder push-ups, 100 shoulder push-ups. That should be a kick in the face, okay? If you look like you're having an upside down seizure and you're just like Brrr, and you finish them in two shakes of a freaking ass crack, then slow it down a little bit. Time under tension, all right? Increase the pain by slowing it down. Try and get a little bit more range through your shoulder. Try and get your head a little bit deeper. Lock the elbow out, all right? Slow it down. All right, once you've finished your 100 shoulder push-ups with a recovery of 10 toe taps, you have 100 toe taps and 10 mothers. Now, probably once you start that, you won't need many rests, all right? Most people could probably punch out a couple big sets of toe taps because it's just a crunch in the end. It's quite a small movement. That's why we're finishing with it. The dogs are out there fighting again. Good dogs. It's a bit gloomy outside this morning. Thanks, Daylight Savings. I hope you guys have transitioned well to Daylight Savings. This house doesn't have much of a choice. We have locks on their rooms. We just throw them in their room and lock them in there. <laughs> I'm not even joking. Doing well, Mellotron, doing well. No, you don't feel like it this morning. You don't always have to enjoy training, guys. All right, discipline. Let discipline take over. All right, Mel always enjoys after the workout. She doesn't enjoy having to do an 11 kilometer run. Why is she doing 11 kilometers? We are doing the calendar run challenge at the moment. So we started on the 1st of October, we ran one kilometer. On the 2nd of October, we ran two. 3rd of October, we ran three kilometers, all right? Today is the 11th of October and we have to run 11 kilometers today. Let's just say my knees are feeling pretty shit. We're not gonna try and do the whole month because that's a little bit silly. That's reserved for some really, really crazy runners that's not quite us. All right, we're gonna try and go to the 14th of October with 14 and then we'll just see what happens after that. But yes, Mel has to go and run 11 kilometers after this. We'll see how far she gets before she has to start work. Because guess what? Life goes on. It's not all about exercising all day. All right, Mel's wiping the sweat from her eye sockets. Nothing like having sweat pouring out of your eyeballs. All right, she's doing well. She's getting through those shoulder push-ups with good form. 
Now, if you've already finished your shoulder push-ups and you're under your toe taps, you're doing well, make sure your form is good. If you finish your toe taps, or some of you will finish your toe taps, obviously just start again. So your goal is just to do 100 reps, those three exercises, right, using the same recovery exercises of 10 reps. All right, the 10 reps are just there just to break it up. So you have to be a bit strategic in how you get through these 100 reps. All right, some of you might have done tried to do 15 or 20 reps at the start, and in the second set, you're like, no, no, not gonna get through that many again. Aim small, miss small. Okay, if you just aim a smaller number, like 10 reps, and just do 10 and 10, 10 and 10, you'll get through the reps quite quickly, as opposed to burning your muscles out in that first set, and then you're looking like a saggy, freaking wet paper bag for the rest of it. How many reps you got left, Nelly? She's got 20 shoulder push-ups left. All right, so probably two sets of 10 she's gonna get through. All right, and then she can get into the toe taps. All right, you have three minutes left of this workout. Three minutes left of this workout. All right, you have done very well up until this stage. All right, let's finish strong. Those that are gonna rejoin us outdoors very soon, I would say that I'm excited to see you but then the introvert inside of me goes, no, Steve, we love being in our mountain villa with our veggie garden and having a relationship with a telephone. If you send me messages recently, haven't replied, it's because I don't like technology and I'm using all my technology up for these classes. So if you contact me and I don't answer, it's not personal. I just don't like telephones. Or emails, just technology in general. This is why everybody needs a Mel in their life. All right, finish them off, Mel, finish them off. Did you finish your shoulder push-ups? Good job. All right, so Melly has just finished her shoulder push-ups and now she's cracking on with 100 toe taps. Now, Mel doesn't like toe taps. She doesn't like them. Not because she doesn't bob her head around, but her form is pretty good. She has a good stretch to the hamstring and they just kick the piss out of her. Kick the shit out of her. Right, every time you need a break, get up, do 10 quick mothers. It's just there to send the blood black to your leg, black, back to your legs, away from your organs, back to your legs, and then you can park your butt and straight back into it again. Oh, the silence in our house is glorious. Beautiful. Or maybe it's silence because I have industrial deafness and all I can hear is a high-pitched ring. I don't know, it's silence in my head. You get used to the ring. But the kids on the other hand, shit, they make noise. Between the dogs and the kids, the constant level of noise in this household, only our walls could talk. Holy shit, it's loud. This is why we have to live in the country. Nobody can hear you scream, Jules. Jules might watch this in the future one day. Jules, you are very loud. You are very loud. <laughs> oh, God. She just did a big woohoo in the background watching some shit upstairs. But the timing was impeccable. So, Jules, if you're watching this in the future, you are very loud. Louder than both your brothers combined. How many reps you up to, Melly? 20 to go. She's got 20 toe taps left. 20 toe taps left. And look at that. Ah, oh, perfect amount of time. You have 90 seconds, Mellotron. 90 seconds. All right, 90 seconds left, team. 90 seconds. Get as far through this that you can. 90 seconds. It's going to go quick. Obviously, if you didn't finish your toe taps or you're still going on your shoulder push-ups, that's fine. That's fine, okay? Obviously, I can't see into my crystal ball. I can't program it for absolutely 100 million percent for everybody. I've only got Mellotron to work with. Poor Mel. All right, Mel, straighten those pike squats. Let's go. Punch them out as many as you can. One minute left. Less than one minute. As far through it that you can. Come on. Make it worth your time. It's got a big day ahead of you. If you're doing this in the morning, if you're doing this live with us right now, and you have an Australian full day ahead of you, good luck. 
All right, make it worth your time and your effort. And if you were on somewhere else on this planet Earth. Daddy. Thanks, Jules. If we had subtitles, you'd see little pops of Julesy's voice popping up. Oh dear. I don't know if it's the coffee. I don't know if it's the coffee. Or the thought about how loud she's gonna get over the years. Holy shit. 30 seconds left, 30 seconds. Last little bit. Come on, don't dog it now. Go hard, come on. Don't be soft. Be hard. Be as tough as frickin' nails. Tough, 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 tough. Come on. Finish it off, finish it off. 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10 seconds. 9, 8, 7, 6, 5 seconds left. 4, 3, and rest. Have a little breather. Okay, you can brain dump everything that you've done previously. Okay, we're now gonna do a workout with four exercises. They'll all roll from one to the next to the next. All right, and what's gonna happen is we're gonna start with six reps for each. Six, 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 six. Then we're gonna go up to eights, tens, twelves, and you're gonna keep increasing the reps until I tell you to stop and then start decreasing the reps. <coughs> Excuse me, bad time to cough. So we're just gonna do sixes, eights, tens, twelves, go as high as we can. And then after a period of time, I'm going to say drop the reps and you're going to try and get back down to six. Okay. The four exercises. First one will be a pump squat. It's only six reps. Six pump squats into six frogs. Six frogs into six pump push-ups. Six pump push-ups into six super sit-ups. And then once you've finished your super sit-ups, back up into eight pump squats, eight frogs, eight pump push-ups, eight super sit-ups, tens, twelves, get that number as high as you can. After a period of time, I'll say drop the reps and three, two, one, change. Whatever you're doing, finish that set and then start working your way back down again. Try and get back down to six. Now we'll move into position. Pump squats first, frogs second, pump push-ups third, super sit-ups fourth. Get ready to start. Pump squats, six reps in three, two, one, and oh. Six pump squats. Now try and do it without standing up. See if you can just push your hands down and then bang straight into it. Good form, Mel. See if you can do that last frog by kicking out and then bang straight into those pump squat uh, pump push-ups. And then once you finish your pump push-ups, just spin straight over, bang, you're right back into your super sit-ups. Alright, the biggest clunkiest movement is to go from this back to your squats. Actually, in a real world, in a good world, it would have been better just to go back in reverse. Oh dear, that will piss me off all day. That flow would have been way cooler, way cooler. Damn it, idiot. All right, so Mel's on eights now. Eight pump squats, eight frogs, eight pump push-ups, eight super sit-ups. All right, we're going up for two minutes. Two minutes. How high can we get that number? In two minutes. How high can you get that number? And then we're going to work down. Three minutes. Well, that's a six minute workout. You're already a minute into it. Six minute workout. Let's make it worth your time. Let's make it worth your effort. All right, less than two minutes. Try and get that number as high as you can. All right, Mel's just finished eights. Right, if you're just starting on eights or you're still cracking them out, doing a good job, remember it's all self-paced. Right, Millie's into tens now. Some will be in front of her, some will be behind. Right, Mel is my law of averages. I've only got Mel to work with, unfortunately. That's nothing personal, Mel. Right, tens now, she's in tens. She just did her 10 frogs, should be. Frogs is miserable after you do some form of isolated leg work. It's a shit sandwich that no one wants to take a bite of. All right, 10 super sit-ups, six, eights, tens. Less than a minute left, less than one minute. All right, we want you to finish the set you're on currently. So if you've started the 12 reps, or you've just started 10 reps, and I say three, two, one, and reverse that shit, Finish the set you're on, 
finish the set, and then on the next set, drop two reps off. All right, so if I call reverse and you're at 10 reps, your next set will be eight. And your goal is to try and get back down to six, if not even four. If you get to six, go down to four. If you get to four, go to two. If you get to two, you might not have worked very hard on the way up. All right, and you're the reason there's a whole HR department. It's for people like you. It's okay. All right, we're gonna start dropping in a second. We're gonna let Mel finish this set. All right, Mel's finishing 12. As soon as Mel's finished that 12th super sit up, she's gonna go on it back down to 10s. I'm gonna coordinate the reversal with old Melatron. Okay, she's rolling over. She's got 12 reps. We're probably gonna do a reversal in 12, 11, 10 seconds, nine, eight, seven, six, five seconds, four, three, two, one, and reverse that shit now. So your next set, finish the set you are on currently. On your next set, drop two reps. Now try and get back down to six. Try and get back down to six. Come on, so Mel's now doing tens now. She just finished 12. She's going to do 10s, 8s, 6s, as fast as she can. Should be reasonably quick. Pump squats are quick. Frogs are quick. Pump push-ups are quick. Super sit-ups is the slowest movement here. It's the slowest one. If you want to move faster, move faster in that movement. Use your arms as momentum. Breathe out. Breathe out on the way up. All right, because you've got these two big things called lungs. You thought I was going to say boobs. No. Lungs, all right? You want to deflate them when you go up. Otherwise, you've got two balloons in your chest, not boobs, lungs. All right? No good trying to, to compress those two lungs. All right? So breathe out on the way up. Breathe out on the way up. All right? Mel's finishing her 10 reps. She's going to go down to eights and then down to sixes. We haven't even done a burpee this workout. I see it on the sheet. You see it on the sheet? <laughs> what are you doing, Mel? Don't give it away. Come on, come on. We're waiting on you, Mel. Don't cry for me, Argentina. The truth is I never left her. All right, Mel's in eight reps now. She's doing her eights. The cumulative age of both Mel and I at nine o'clock at night. Come on, finish that rep off, Mel. Finish the eights. Right, she's finishing up her pump push-ups. Roll over into the super sit-ups, eight reps. No, I might even be able to coordinate the six reps as soon as Mel finishes her sixth super sit-up. All right, this part of the workout will end and then you know what's coming at the end. Thanks a lot, Mel. Thanks for giving it away. Shit. You're like that person at Christmas that just can't wait until the person what opens the person? present. God, man. Like the present's sitting in the car. You don't have to tell them what it is before they see it. Come on, Mel. Six frogs. Come on, we're almost done. Push, push. 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10 seconds. 9, 8, 7, 6, 5 seconds. 4, 3. Rest. All right, standing up, standing up. All right, Mel gave it away. Thanks a lot for ruining Christmas, Mel, you freaking Grinch. Okay, we're gonna do burpees to finish with. So, down, out, in, jump. Like we did with the mountain climbers, we're gonna do six sets, 20 seconds on, 10 seconds off. This is the finisher. Julesy's got her outfit, it's only taking her 40 minutes. Okay, move in, get ready for burpees. Julesy, you're distracting us, we've got the last bit. All right, get ready for burpees. Last bit, six sets. Burpees in three, two, one burpees. 19, 18, 17, 16, 15. Come on, Mel, you're missing out. 14, 13, 12, 11, 10 seconds, 9. Go, Mel. 8, 7, 6, 5 seconds. Come on, 4, 3, push. Rest. One set down, 5 to go. The workout's over. All right, let's get ready to rock and roll in 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Burpees. Go. 19. 18, 17, 16, 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10 seconds, 9, 8, 7, 
six, five seconds, four, three, push, rest, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, begin, 19, 18, 17, 16, 15, come on, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10 seconds, come on, nine, eight, seven, six, five seconds, four, three, push, yes, nine, eight, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one, burpees, go, 19, 18, 17, 16, 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, come on, 10 seconds, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5 seconds, hang in there, 4, 3, push it, 2, rest, 2 more sets, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, 2, 1, burpees, go, 19, 18, 17, 16, 15, 14, come on, 13, 12, 11, 10 seconds, go, 9, 8, 7, 6, come on, 5, 4, 3, push, push, yes, one more set, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5 seconds, last bit, 3, 2, 1, last set, go, rip it up, 19, 18, 17, 16, 15, 14, 13, 12, 11, 10 seconds, 9, 8, 7, 6, 5, 4, 3, rest. Good work, Mel. And your daughter just made her appearance with all her accessories. Fashion. Okay, take a knee. Take a knee. Don't leave. We've got to do a quick stretch so you don't get injured, you old fossils. All right, take a nice big pace forward with your front leg. Square your hips, push forward, push forward, unlock the back hip, raise the arm up and back, look up to the sky, breathe out, increase the stretch through that back hip. Hold for five, four, three, two, one, release. Toe pointing up, slight bend in the knee, letting forward slightly, feel that stretch up the back of your hamstring. Hold that stretch for five, four, three, two, one, release. Changing legs, nice big pace forward, square your hips. Push forward, push forward, unlock the hip, raise the arm up and back, look up to the sky, breathe out, increase the stretch. Hold for five, four, three, two, one. Release, toe pointing up, slight bend in the knee, leaning forward slightly, feel that stretch up your hamstring. Breathe out, hold for five, four, three, two, one. Release, standing up, feet and knees together, forearms under the back of the knees. Jules, you're distracting me. All right, forearms on the back of the knees. Try and stand up, feel a stretch over your shoulder blades for three, two, one. Release, reaching up to the sky. Big stretch out your back slightly. Crack your spine if you need to, you pack of fossils. Straight back down again, Mel. Back down again, come on. Hug your legs, try and stand up. Feel the stretch for three, two, one. Release, reaching up to the sky. Big stretch. Arch your back slightly, right arm down your spine, pulling down on the elbow, keep the weight off your neck. Hold that stretch for three, two, one, release, changing arms, pulling down on the elbow, keep the weight off your neck. Hold that stretch for three, two, one, release, find a door arch for another human being for a chest stretch, elbow to elbow or elbow to door, lean away, fluid across your pec, make sure you do it on both sides. Good job, Mel, got any points? Oh, two to go. I recommend don't have a massive feed of pizza the night before training. No regrets. Stay strong. See you guys.